Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. Today we're actually going to a little collection that I got myself for Christmas through JCM Cards. And honestly, just opening the package up because it's so large that I won't be able to open it on camera, I think that they might just be my next favorite Poke store. Make sure to subscribe, like, and if you want to enter a giveaway, just comment down below your favorite shiny Pokemon. Keep in mind that we still have giveaways from prior videos that are still open and available. I've been talking for too long. Let's get straight into it. And the first item on this list is a shiny Mega Gyarados playmat. It's actually from the 20, December 2017 era. And it is absolutely massive. So it's going to be an American size playmat. Not like the wimpy, small Japanese ones. I, as you can see, we have upgraded ours to the American size EV from the Radiant Collection that we opened just a couple of days ago. And this one is going to be our newest playmat that we're going to be showcasing our videos. Thanks so much, JCM Cards, for sending this over to me. And let's see how it looks. Whoa, look at that. Gyarados is a little, <laughs> looks a little chunky here. But wow, it is amazing. So I'm going to roll it back up, and then we're going to move into our other item. For the second and third items that they sent over, it's going to be more pop collection figurines of Pokemon. This time is going to be Charizard, number 843, and Alakazam. 855. They look pretty legit. A little, you know, a little dusty, but nothing that, but nothing that is not collectible. And actually, it still has the, I believe. Oh, it actually has a like protective film here. Huh. That's probably to protect it from scratches and such on shipping, I would say. I'm gonna leave it where it is, and we're gonna move this to the side. And go through our other item. For our fourth item, before we get into the big one, we got a little, a small Fusion Strike collection here. Mini portfolio for 60 cards. Good to just carry around for your, for your small showcases if you go to a Pokemon TGC tournament. And since our last item was a portfolio, we do have a Celebrations, a 25th Anniversary Celebrations portfolio featuring, that's right, the Red Cheeks Pikachu. Wow, look at that. A little scratched up, but it looks pretty good. Pretty good so far. And they did include this. What it is, I don't know. This came a little unglued, but I guess it's okay because it could have gotten stuck to the card, and that's the worst case scenario. I actually don't know what this could be. It's marked two, so let's see what it is. I wonder what they are. Let's see. All right, face down. Are they both face down? Yes. All right, we're going to reveal one by one. These are the jumbo cards. So let's see. Oh, we have the Darkrai GX. Oh my goodness. JCM cards. How did you know that Darkrai was my favorite Pokemon? Whoa. I think I already have one, but just look at that hollow. My goodness. And I think it's actually in a pretty good condition. I don't even want to touch it that much. Whoa, I see a little whiting on the on the on the ends there, but my goodness, look at that. See if I can get some shine on it. Whoop. I just love what they did with the eyes. The eye hollow, amazing. And is this going to be another dark ride? Or do we have a... Oh, it is. It's Umbreon and Dark Ride GX Jumbo card. Oh, my goodness. If you are ever going to order something for yourself or maybe for someone else, you have to put in the customer details what it is that you would like to see. I'm pretty sure if I would have put maybe Rayquaza or something else, this would have been a lot. All right, and moving on, we are going to start opening the big, big ticket items. So for our first big ticket item, you got it. It's going to be an Elite Trainer Evolving Sky box. Now, if you've been keeping up with the times, Evolving Sky's prices have skyrocketed. So I'm really happy that they were able to send me one before the big evolving prize boom. So it's a pretty good box. It does have some light wear and tears here, but that's not what we're here for. We're here to open this bad boy. So let's, let me get my box cutter and I'm ready. Let's open. Do I think there's going to be a reprint? I'm not really sure. Pokemon company knows what they're doing. It's a very valuable set. And I expect that if they want to keep the prices up and the hype up for evolving cries or evolving sky sets, that they won't do a reprint. But but that's not the case for us. We have it right here. We have an Evolving Skies ETB collection. And I'm pretty sure you guys already know 
We have the sleeves featuring Leafeon, Jolteon, Flareon, and Umbreon. Very cool looking sleeves. We have our energy pack. We have our separators. Ah ha ha, our separators. I remember. We have our burn markers and we have our awesome translucent dark dye. And our amazing eight packs of evolving skies. Here is the code. Let me put all of this away and we're going to be opening the evolving skies pack. All right, team, here it is. Here we are. Let's go in. They're named the Involving Cries, so I do not expect hits, but I'm going to hype it up. I think that we're going to get something. I'm feeling pretty good. Let's see what we got. We have a Flaffy into a Hollow Jump Love, and here is the code. All right, here we go. Pack two. They have been shuffled. I did shuffle them, so we don't know where the last pack magic is going to lie. Hopefully in the last pack, but let's see. C dot into the time pool, into the... Not regular, rare, Smurgle. Smurgle? Smurgle? Let me know how you say it down in the comments below. Here we go. Three out of eight. Is this the last pack? Containing all of the magic? It's reverse drowsy into a hollow pincer. I told you, I'm already, I'm already internally crying. I don't know about you guys. Four out of four. Is this going to be the lucky one? I think so. The lower you go, the higher your luck chances. That's what I heard. From a very reliable source. We got the Drampa into the regular rare Gigalith. Send a moon match into the code. All right. Now, here we go. This, this has to be something. We got the Temple into the Psyduck, Eevee, Cutie Pipe, our boy, Pikachu. Herdier, reverse into the Galarian Articuno Hollow. Okay, not that bad. That isn't that bad, actually. All right, here we go. Three. Third pack from last. The last pack magic has seeped into this a little bit. Moon Sun Badge into the Glaceon VMAX. What did I tell you guys? I knew we were going to get a hit. I didn't know what. But here we go. We're going to showcase it right next to right next to the brother. We got into the Glaceon VMAX. Amazing. Here we go. Umbreon. Will it hold the coveted Moonbreon? Let us see. I'm hoping. Here it is. Vagon, Wubat, Marshadow into a regular Sharpedo. Ooh. I'm crying. I am totally crying. And here we go, last pack. So this contains all of our magic. It could have landed anywhere, but it somehow always ends up in the last pack. Why is that? I don't know. I think it's, you know, score diggers up. Regardless, here we go. Tentacool into the Hoppip, into the Reverse Side Duck, into the Hollow Kyurum. All right, and that's going to be it. Our only hit from this, from this Elite Trainer boxes of Evolving Cries, and I definitely believe it. They've earned the name. It's going to be our Glaceon VMAX. Very nice hollow. Very nice shine. I do like I do like the evolution. So Amazing job. And for the next item that we're going to open, it's something that I'm very proud to open here on this channel because it's going to be my first video. But due to technical difficulties, all the footage got deleted. And it's going to be a Charizard Ultra Premium Collection Box from the Sword and Shield set. This was, this was a very, very, very absolutely hyped box and here we go i had about four to open this is going to be just one i'm very sorry but that footage is forever gone so let's open it right up and this is going to also contain evolving cries but we are going to open it and if you've never seen the quality of the charizard ultra premium collection box you're going to experience it firsthand here it is an absolutely amazing box with great design. Here we have our Gigantamax Charizard. I have to flip this around or else it's not going to fit. We have our Playmat, which honestly, I'm going to keep sealed. If anybody want, if any one of you wants it, just leave a comment down below. It's actually a pretty nice mat. I already have one. I don't want to. I do not want to open it here. All right. And here we go. We have our first slide out. 
our first slide out holder here. I'm gonna put it back. We have our Charizard V, V Star, and V Max, I believe. Collection set here. That's gonna go into the giveaway. We have Lost Origin, three, I believe. Oh, two in this case. Astral Radiance, three. Brilliant Stars, three. We're gonna open our other one. We have our V Star marker, which is regular, but the good one is that you have the Charizard gold coin featuring Charizard in his Gigant Gigantamax form. Charizard in his Gigant Gigantamax form. We'll put that there. Then we have our Fusion Strike, three. Evolving Skies, Prize, three. Vivid Voltage, and in this case, we have a Darkness Ablaze. Now, if you haven't seen this, the last slot, the only thing is you have your extra goodies here. You have your Gigantamax sleeves, your absolutely amazing golden damage counters, and the custom-made poison and burn markers. This is only worthwhile if you played the actual, you know, trading card game. So let me move, let me move this out of the way, and we're gonna open the packs. All right, we just shuffled the pack, and we're gonna go straight into it. We have shuffled the packs, will, the order that they came in, everything. Right now, our first one is gonna be Astral Radiance with the Nicket, Hoppish. Quillfish, Cyndaquil, Grow Life, and I do see something into an alternate, and not an alt, into a Trainer Gallery Galarian Articuno. Oh my goodness, look at this. And do we follow it up with, or, oh, and we do. We do follow it up with an Origin Form Palkia V-Star. This was the same hype that I had when I opened the four ones that are completely forever lost in time, so. Whoa! And we had similar hits too. The code cards for those are also lost. I'm sorry, guys. I apologize. But here we are. We're going to showcase them probably here so that they don't interfere. I know that the, you're not going to be able to see them properly. And I apologize. But that is the showcase. All right. Going into Brilliant Stars featuring Charizard. And I am trying to complete my master collection for Brilliant Stars. So if this holds the alternate art, Charizard V. Where is Charizard fighting Venus? Or if you haven't seen it, definitely go check it out. I'm going to absolutely flip. Oh, we have a Flareon. Uh, Trainer Gallery Flareon 01. I already have this one. Maybe I can put that in the giveaway. I'll definitely sleeve it. But that's going to go into the showcase, into the regular mute. All right, wow. Two for two. Here we go. Are we going to be able to pull it out of the Fusion Strike? I moved it around a bit just so that we have space to showcase the hits. And is this a Yukimori card? It is. Oh, look at that. Look at that snom. That is a cute one. If you don't know, Yukimori makes them out of clay for all of her illustrations, which is pretty cool. Extra drill into a regular Gudra. Oh, and the code card was reversed. Oh, I actually got a miscut, guys. Look at that. My first ever miscut, and it's a code card. Aw, oh, darn it. <laughs> so here, here you guys go. There, this is supposed... Hopefully you don't get a miscut on Pokemon Live. Oh, my goodness. But there it is. That's my first miscut ever. All right, we're going to pull from this stack into another Astral Radiance. Let's see. So we got a miscut code card. Actually, you know what? I'm going to showcase that. Miscut code card. I don't know. Does anybody collect miscut code cards? Let me know. All right, we got the Pseudo Wood of the Convy Drifloon into the Reverse Ponyard with that, you know, hand-drawn art style into a Hisuin Avaluga. This is going to... We're going to get into the Vivid Voltage pack. And this is, I think you can pull the Pikachu, the Punkachu from this. So let's see if we have some luck here into the Mudbray Puccina Reverse Wimscott into the Tucanon Regular. Not a problem. All right, Darkness Ablaze, we're going to pull from this stack right now. Let's see, do we have anything absolutely phenomenally crazy in Darkness Ablaze? I actually don't remember. I think it's a Charizard, though. Is it? Hmm. Into the reverse, Skitty. Look at that. Lucky, lucky me. Into the Rhyperior V. That's a hit for someone. Another miscut? Oh, no. It was just reversed. Okay. I thought I was going to be two for two in code cards. Oh, my goodness. Into the Lost Origin. So, if you guys know, if you've been following my shorts, I have been trying to find the Giratina. The AA Giratina. Alternate R Giratina, which is absolutely sick. So, let's see. Are we going to be able to pull it out of here into the Wurmple? Reverse Porygon C into the regular Mr. Mime. 
into neutral deck. All right, now we got the Fusion Strike coming in hot. Let's see, we've pulled something out of the Fusion Strike already, which was that Galarian Gallery Flareon. So let's see if we have anything absolutely crazy into the Sydney, into the Vicar Vault, and into nothing. Oh my good. Another miscut go card? What is going on? I am just hitting all of the miscuts, guys. I have no idea. Why can't they be on cards, right? All right, here we go. This is Lost Origin. We only got two packs of Lost Origin this one, which is kind of weird. Into the matchup, Yukimori. I know that one for sure. Into the Litwick, Yukimori again. Into the Mawile. And into the regular bear. Let me flip it and not cover it. <laughs> All right. Evolving Cries or Rayquaza. You have failed me once before. Will you fail me today? Let's see. Into the Love Disc. Dweeble. Hip oh. I do see something shiny there on the camera. Let's see. Hippopotas, Sarua, to Psyduck, into a reverse Bergmatite, into a Garvador B. Garvador B. Well, well, we got something, but it's literally trash. What was Pokemon thinking with that kind of design? Imagine just your garbage just coming out and living. No, thank you. Keep your nightmares to yourself. We got the Phalanx reverse and into a Lucario V. Into another. Into another miscut code card. What is going on right now? I have all of the miscuts. That's three for three on miscut code cards, guys. My goodness, Evolving Cries. Please, no garbage this time. Please, no garbage. Starting off strong with the Pikachu. That's always something good to see if it's your first card. Into the Reverse Trigono? Is that how you say that one? Into the Appleton. Into the regular code. I don't know how this works. How did I get absolutely three miscut code cards? I don't know. And here we go with the Brilliant Stars. With the brilliant stars, so we already know what we're looking for in here. It, it is that Charizard, alternate Art V, and we have the Manaphy. No luck there, but that is eight. Okay, I'm not crying. I'm trying to leave that Umbreon to gather some more. <laughs> we have an Evolving Skies Umbreon, and then a Brilliant Stars. So we'll see. Does this one also contain a miscut code card? We will have to find out. Into the Rufflet, into the Reverse Rapidash, into eight. Regirock, regular. All right, here we go. This is the last two, the ones that I'm most hyped for. If this one has the Moonbryon, we win that life. Let's see. Let's see. Moonbryon, are you in here? Ooh, it has enough time to gather all of the last pack magic. And it's the Crustle into the Hollow Victining. Into the code card, which is not miscut, so. All right, this is the last pack with the Arceus Brilliant Stars. Are we going to be able to pull off an amazing pull from the last pack? Is this going to contain all of our magic? Come on, JCM cards. Spirit, don't fail me now. Into the reverse Heatran. Into a regular rare Heatran. All right, well, we got the double, the double look there. And into the code card. Oh my goodness, these boxes have been absolutely atrocious for some, like me, and absolutely bomb for others. So here, let's let's recap, shall we? We have our three miscut code cards, a Galarian Gallery Flareon, which actually, it looks pretty nice. The edging, the centering looks pretty good. Let's turn it around. Ooh, that actually does look pretty good. Is it ever going to go up in value? I do not know. We have the Galarian Articuno V. I mean, it is an EV evolution, so. This one, a bit off-centered. We have the Origin Form Palkia V-Star, which once Lost Origin came out, it was actually a, a TCG menace, an absolute menace. It probably won't be anymore. Those were our hits from the Charizard boxes. You know that the for the Charizard box, the main value holds in the promos. Those promos are pretty rare. Those promos are pretty rare to come in good condition, with good centering and absolutely Phenomenal. Let's see if your giveaway is going to be looking 
from the one card that I can see, which is this one, it looks pretty good. So remember, this is in the giveaway. Make sure to leave your favorite shiny Pokemon down in the comments down in the comments below. So here we enter the exceptionally rare pile, something that I haven't even been able to see into, which is going to be our sealed number one. And we're gonna see what this holds into the number one envelope. And we have loose cards. Oh, we have packs, more <laughs> packs. JCM, what have you done? Oh, and we have a Beckett. We have an actual Beckett graded card. We're gonna leave that toward the end. We're gonna leave that toward the end. Let's open everything else before. We're gonna see what that holds. All right, so we have Fusion Strike, Fusion Strike, Fusion Strike. We have four Fusion Strike sealed packs, and we have, oh, a sleeve deck. Awesome. Oh, featuring Gengar. These are actually pretty cool. We have, a, we have sleeves featuring Gengar. These are actually pretty cool. I thought they were gonna be cards, but they're not. They're sleeves, but maybe that Beckett and Castle are actually gonna is gonna actually be something phenomenal. So let me open these packs. So let's open them and let's dig into the fusion. Fusion Strike does have that Gengar V Max that I have not pulled as of yet. So let's see. Will these hold it? Will this have will this have better luck? We'll have to see. Into the Kufant, Impedip Snome again, Yonix, Geodude into the Maractus. Okay. Not bad. We're starting, you know, we get our, rid of our bad luck first. And here we go into the next fusion strike featuring uh, Volt, 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 some Volt Helm, right? All right, here we go. Mankey looking cute. Actually, this is one of my favorite iterations of Mankey. It actually looks pretty adorable. We got Krogunk, Pansamir, Gloomy, Arakuda. Sorry, Mankey fan, but I'm just telling the truth. Ryzen into the regular rare Toxic Pro. Here we go into the Fusion Strike third. It's okay. These two are going to contain absolute bangers. Absolute bangers. Let's see what we have here. I already feel it. This is going to be it. We have the Kissy Face Jinx, Mantine Grubbin, Bayukamori, Smurgle. I know it when I know it. Spongy Gloves into the Mew V. Okay. That would have been nice for last season, not for this season. And we have. The last pack, the last pack featuring Gengar VMAX. Will this hold a Gengar VMAX AA? We will just have to see. I took that out a bit rough, but I don't think it damaged the card. Into the, and we have the Galarian Darumaka. Darumaka, Slilipi, Stuffle, Sandy Gas into the Plusle. And I see something there. What is it going to be? It's going to be the Tyranitar V. Oh my goodness. All right. Not bad, but not that great either. And and I know that you guys have been waiting for it. It is going to be the reveal of the Beckett graded card. This is going to be my first Beckett ever in my collection. I do PSA, which I think PSA is here. So for Beckett, it's probably going to be here. So let me hold it like this and flip it. Oh! It's the Rayquaza VMAX alternate art from Beckett. Oh my goodness. So we know it's not a 10 or else it would be a black label, right? So let's see what it's going to be. The great. Thank you so much, JCM cards. This is going to be a wonderful addition to my sealed collection. And it's going to be graded at a oh, Gem Mint 9.5. Oh my goodness. So honestly, me being a PSA collector, I have to tell you that the Beckett the Beckett sleeves feel absolutely more sturdy than the PSA ones. This actually feels like a solid piece of work. And my goodness, does it contain an absolute piece of work. It's the Rayquaza VMAX Alternate Art. Wow. Let's, let's, let's just adore it for a second more. Oh my God. The Sword Pulse and Max Burst. Absolutely ecstatic. And, it's the, and it, I think it actually comes sleeved also. Double protection. And this is going to be a tough act to follow. Let's see what the rest of the envelopes hold. All right, before we open our final products, I just want to also let you know what came in the box in this JCM mystery box. It's going to be JCM card sticker, 
and booster boxes. So we have one Lost Origin, one Silver Tempest, and the other one is another Lost Origin. We are holding the Lost Origin packs for an absolutely massive opening of, of six booster boxes. If that envelope that we opened was exceptionally rare, I wonder what these envelopes that we're about to open are going to be. It's the Omnius Black Mailer envelopes. They're not even. I feel like this is a graded card. And I feel that this is... They might be both graded cards. And this one contains sleeves. I'm not sure. There's something moving around in there. Let's open our first one and see what JCM put in here. JCM, you guys are absolutely amazing. Your customer support is amazing. So we have a X and Y Phantom Forces booster pack. Oh my goodness. What else is in here? Sorry, that, that just completely derailed my train of thought. We have a Lost Origin. And we have a Astral Radiance. Okay. I feel something more loose in there. Another Brilliant Stars. Absolutely. You know I need the luck. And this is a Pokemon Go. Okay, there's something else in here. Is this the graded card? Nope. This is going to be another X and Y booster pack. Oh my goodness. Absolutely stacked with my favorite, my favorite pack. So we're going to leave the graded card for last. So we got the XY, the Pokemon Go, Brilliant Stars, Astral Radiance, Lost Origins, and the Phantom Forces. Wow, what an absolute treat this is. I'm going to open all of them right now. All right, so I organized the packs from least favorite. They're all my favorites, for, but from least favorite to most favorite. And we're going to start off strong with the Pokemon Go pack that came in from the XY reveal. Let's see if we can get a Radiant Charizard. That would be very nice. Into the Magikarp, Onyx, Eevee, Nummel, Versatu, into the... Hollow Venusaur. Hollow, debatable if it's a hit or not. Especially with Scarlet and Violet coming out. Now every pack is going to have a hollow. Did you guys hear about that? I'm absolutely stoked. So let's see. Bar let's see this Astral Radiant pack, shall we? Eevee, Heracross, Teddy Ursula. Into Reverse, Regirock. Ooh, 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 ooh. Into the Le regular Leafeon. Ooh. All right. Lost Origin. Are you going to be the Holy Grail? Featuring our boy, the Giratina. So you know what this means. If this holds the alternate R Giratina, I'm just going to flip out into the reverse liquid, into the regular Clefable. Mm. Nothing, nothing so far. Our pulls from the packs today have been a little, a little light. But let's see if Brilliant Stars can pull it out of here. Let's see. Can you pull us out, Brilliant Stars? Arceus, please. You were on the cover into the reverse Moltres, into the Sama Santa V. Ooh, we've already pulled this one last time. Into the code card. We've already pulled you. All right, now here we go. It's the actual XY base set from, I believe, ooh, I don't even know. Years. These are coming in at 40. Unlocks one booster pack. Here you guys go. Hopefully you guys have the rare. I do. I don't. I do not know the pack trick. I think it's three from the back. Right, three because it's ten. Or actually, I have no idea. I have. I actually have no idea. So we're just gonna go with this. If the next card is the rare, I know I failed. So we got the fairy garden, into the whirlipede, into Sharna. Ooh. That's a face I haven't seen in a long time. Into Phantom. Ooh, and I think I I think we got a glimpse of something back there. The Phantom into ooh. Metal energy. And I don't want to reveal anything. So Ink J into the Slugma. Into the Pan Sage. Into the reverse Beedrill. Oh my goodness. Just look at that. Look at that reverse hollow Beedrill. And into A. Emoga EX, they are coming back. The I know that the EX is going to be lowercase, but this is what I'm expecting. Just this absolutely amazing quality card. Wow. These, I'm going to consider the reverse hollow as a hit, honestly. That Beedrill looks absolutely fire. And here we go. We're going to go into the XY Phantom Forces. One of the very old packs here. 
the XY era. What is that? 2000. Ooh, XY, 2007, maybe? We have Murkrow. Oh, and it does have. Uh, the camera is picking it up. It does have that line there. Ooh, probably sat somewhere way too long. No reverse card trick here. Joltik into another reverse grass type into this Leviani right now. And do we have an absolute banger? We have a regular Mighty Anna. Here you guys go. Hope you guys pull something out. All right, not so bad. I'm actually very excited to have these in the personal collection. The reverse, the reverse <laughs> rares, both grass, reverse, ra reverse hollows. I'm actually very excited to have these in the collection. The reverse hollow, Liviani, reverse hollow video, and the Emoga. Nice. Let's look at that. Oh, they're coming back, baby. They are coming back and they're here to stay. All right. And here we have the final pack. And I believe it's a graded pack. And it's not labeled, so I have no idea. Maybe they threw this in just for funsies. Let's see. I don't know what it could be, but it could be... Oh, okay, it's... I thought it was a Beckett. It felt similar to a Beckett. It is not a Beckett. It's actually a CGC graded card. And... It's actually a CGC graded card, and I believe they're the same as a PSA, right? So it's here. All right. Amazing. So let's see. Let's review what it is. Boom. Oh, it is the Jesse and James Pokemon 19. Poke it is the Jesse and James Pokemon from Hidden Fates Full Art Trainer card. Look at that. Oh my goodness. Let's see. Is it a 10? Is it a 10? It's going to be a mint 9. I just absolutely adore the OG Team Rocket. Look at that shine. Nice. CGC, we're going to add you to our collection. Once again, so oh, and there's something else in the pack. I have completely missed it because I thought it was just the greater card. All right, but there's nothing else in there now. All right, this is it. But what is it gonna be? It's going to be a oh, a dark cry, another dark cry. Amazing. This is a black star promo from I believe 2017. But just look at that. Oh man, I love it. And it looks like and it's a pretty amazing condition. They have tripled seal it. So this must be that it's going to be graded at a 10. Let's look at it. My goodness, that is a phenomenal looking card. An absolute phenomenon. I should have probably left it in the sleeve, but it's okay. Oh, we do have some whitening right there. So it's probably not going to grade at a 10. But the centering and everything else looks absolutely great. It is going to end with the absolute... All right, let's give the showcase one, one good go around, shall we? So we're going to start with the Jesse and James. CGC Mint 9. Thanks so much, JCM Cards. The Darkrai. Wow. Absolutely amazing. Darkrai promo. We got the Leviani. Reverse Hollow. Look at that. Into the reverse hollow Beedrew. I wish I could have seen another design, right? Other than grass. But my goodness, they look nice. Into the Emoga EX. Cute li our cute little our cute little flying squirrel. Into our Galarian Articuno V. There it is. I love the hollow on these. And the eyes, of course. Mint. Absolutely mint into the origin form. Palkia, V Star, the menace, the absolute menace of October to December, I guess. <laughs> to the Beck graded 9.5 Gem Mint Rayquaza V Max. Whoa. Double protected, double sealed. We have our, our, our trainer gallery, 01 Flareon. And who can forget the rarest of the rare, the three miscut coke cards. Absolutely amazing. This has been an absolute blast to open. Thank you so much, JCM Cards. And thank you for letting me treat myself to a little Christmas present last year. We'll see if we can do it again this year. Because who says Christmas doesn't come twice a year? Thanks so much for stopping by. And I'll catch you later.